In time for the holiday shopping season, Portland police began their foot patrols today focusing on the downtown area. And so police chief Bob Day says that he hopes this is a way to help people feel more safe when they're in the city. Brandon Thompson going beyond the headlines tonight with reaction to these very noticeable patrols. Brandon? Well, businesses I spoke with say that they are happy to see this extra support because many of them tell me they've been taking security into their own hands the last several years. As the holidays approach, we're getting ready. <laughs> yes. yes. The staff at Muji in downtown Portland are preparing for a season they hope is busier than years past. Customers are definitely coming back, but um, it's been rough. Shoplifting in the store and broken windows outside of it have been a regular occurrence at their location near Pioneer Courthouse Square. Kobayashi hopes walking patrols by Portland police can help defuse the situation. We report every incident, uh, every time somebody breaks the window, but, you know, having more police presence will really help. It, seems. And it gives us that opportunity to hear those concerns and hopefully uh, continue to come up with good strategies to hopefully um, be able to mitigate some of that. Every day, starting today through January 3rd, a pair of officers will patrol Northwest and the downtown core from 10 in the morning through 6 in the evening. We're trying to get out a little bit more. A change up from running from call to call right. in a police cruiser. You guys have a good one. The difference uh, between being in a patrol car and um, on foot, it just gives you a different presence. It gives you that opportunity to slow things down and interact with folks. Um, and it's just a different way. Foxworth says officers will address crimes as they see them and mental health crises as well. A lot of times, you know, police officers are that first kind of gateway to getting people connected with services. So uh, that's one of the other important pieces that we can uh, provide. With the goal of providing a better downtown for everyone. Chief Day says that he hopes this makes officers more approachable as well. When announcing this program, Day said that there will be no new resources to help staff it. So PPB is going to have to make it work with the officers they have. Live in downtown Portland, Brandon Thompson, Coin 6 News.